In this video we will synthesize acridone. Acridone has the structure of acridine with a carbonyl group at position 9. Acridone is being investigated in the production of anti-malarial drugs. For this synthesis, we are going to use the phenylanthranilic acid obtained in one of the videos of my channel. Acridone is obtained by cyclizing phenylanthranilic acid by the action of sulfuric acid with loss of a water molecule. In an Erlenmeyer flask of 50 milliliters, we put 3.6 grams of phenylanthranilic acid and slowly add 8.5 milliliters of concentrated sulfuric acid. To heat during four hours in a water bath. We allow to cool and it is poured slowly in a glass of 250 milliliters with 85 milliliters of water. For the pouring, slide the product of the reaction along the vessel walls. In this way we minimize the reaction of the sulfuric acid with the water. Immediately a precipitate is formed. Collect the precipitate by suction and wash with little water. The collected solid cake is dispersed in about 150 milliliters of water and boiled for 40 minutes. Once cold, the precipitate is collected again by suction. The cake is dispersed in a solution of 2.6 grams of sodium carbonate diluted in 35 milliliters of water. This is done to remove the unreacted phenylanthranilic acid. The unreacted acid forms a water-soluble salt with the carbonate that passes through the filter. Wash the solid cake with water several times. The product obtained is dried at 60 degrees for 12 hours. The melting point of acridone is 360 degrees. In my laboratory I do not have any method to determine such a high melting point. I have set up a rudimentary apparatus to melt the acridone and with a digital thermometer I measure the temperature. When acridone is heated in a crucible, it is observed to sublime with yellow color. The yellow color is the original color of acridone. One way to purify the acridone would be by sublimation. The test was not very accurate but sufficient to determine that the product obtained has a melting point greater than 350 degrees. The total yield of this synthesis was 69%.